Alright, so today we'll be looking at the Hellshock pistol. Uh, the pistol that I have here is the orchestrated Hellshock. And it is a weapon that can draw from any suitable loot source. However, it has an increased chance to draw from Gigamind, who is located in the Meridian Metroplex on Promethea. And I'll show you how to get there in just one moment. The red text is... I had not thought death had undone so many, which I think is a Dante Inferno quote. Don't quote me on that though. Uh, there's a 20% weapon charge speed on this one and a 2.9 times weapon zoom. However, the most notable thing about it is that it has the shock and incendiary element effect to it. And it does 101 damage per second. 36% chance, at least for the one that I have. It is uh, 66 damage times 2 per hit, 80% accuracy, 87% handling, 1.6 second reload time, fire rate is 9.7 sec second, and the magazine size is 3. Or 33. I don't know why I said 3. And so this is what the gun looks like. Looks nifty. Does not look like a pistol, even though it is. It is a Maliwan weapon. And so the, this is the stats for the uh, incendiary and the stats for the shock elemental. And it tells you uh, the different um, accessories per... Different types per accessory. So the barrel is what gives it the plus 20% magazine size, plus 25% damage. And right here you see the uh, negative weapon sway. And this is where we lose some damage. This is also where we lose some damage. And so you can uh, feel free to press pause on the screen as we went over that. So I'll show you how to get to Megamind. Again, it could drop from any suitable loot source, but the best person to farm for it is Megamind. And that would be on Promethea and the Meridian Metroplex. And so the starting fast travel spot is located right here. And then to get to Megamind, all you would have to do is basically just get to right here. And I'll speed up the video just to take us there. And so, and so Gigamind is one of the early story bosses. Uh, you'll see zero. I'll cut through the door here. You have to complete that part of the storyline in order to get here. And all you gotta do is just climb up the stairs and here will be Gigamind. Min max. <laughs> I have not had a hard time with him. However, I also use this bad boy. Making him a pretty quick fight. You just have to be careful if you do do that to be sure which way he goes flying because I have soft locked it before. He whatsoever. Get out. Look at that. That's awesome. I love this shotgun so much. Oh, hello. So I just wanted to show you a quick overview of Gigamind and where to farm the health shock. Uh, typically it would come out in a golden shine like that. And again with it, you fire two bullets per shot, which is nice, and they do bounce. One tip is that you can continually press the fire button to, uh, with a slight delay to keep it close to firing without actually firing it off, just to uh, make sure that you 
use it as effective as you can. However, doing so does come at the cost of running. So it may not be the best thing to do, but it is something to keep in mind. Uh, just for where we are, it is a very effective weapon. Again, I, this gun here easily outclassed all my other weapons uh, in damage and the effective for the elements. So it is something that I think is very valuable to try to get early on. When I was farming Gigamind, again, this is probably the seventh time I may have beaten them. I've gotten three legendaries so far, and that is not using any of the... I'm not sure what they're called, actually. It's bonuses from the Borderlands Science uh, to get easier loot drops. Not using any of those. I defeated Gigamind seven times, and I've gotten three legendaries. The Hellshock Pistol. A shield, and this time right here we got. Just let me one moment. It's uh. We're saving it for last. It's uh something savory. It is the smart gun XXL. Busy gun brain like crane. I think that is actually. Wow, that's a gorgeous gun. I think that's actually, um, I want to say Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I want to say, not sure. Anyways, so that is how to get the Hellshock Pistol. Very useful, very effective, especially early on. Super fast reload time. And overall, I think it's a very valuable pistol. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.